Let's take a look inside the production process of our wine bacteria at our plant in Saint-Simon in France. Acquired 35 years ago to provide freeze-dried starter cultures for French sparkling wines, we now produce more than 35 different bacteria strains of Unicoccusoni and Lactiplantabacillus plantarum, used reliably in direct inoculation worldwide. At l'Allemand Oenology, we fully control our production process from the lab to packaging to ensure the quality, safety, consistency and a high activity of our wine bacteria to achieve a fast and complete malolactic fermentation in different wine conditions and to contribute to wine quality. We have developed a strong expertise and set up very specific production processes. The different production steps are complex and require a careful attention to ensure an optimal adaptation of our bacteria to wine conditions and guarantee their quality and efficiency. Including all our quality controls at each step, the full production process of an active freeze-dried Unicoccus uni is long and takes more than two months. The first stages of bacterial multiplication are done at lab scale in sterile conditions from a cryotube where the identity and the purity of the strain is controlled to an active inoculum. After ensuring the absence of contamination, this pure culture is seeded in large scale fermenters. We continue to grow our bacteria under sterile conditions. The composition of the culture medium and the environmental perimeters are optimized for each bacteria strain. At this stage, we apply different stresses to adapt our bacteria to wine conditions. This step is crucial and at the heart of our expertise to ensure the good survival and malolactic fermentation activity after inoculation in wine. The application of specific stress during the production of the bacteria induces physiological changes in the bacteria cells changes that will enable them to withstand the harsh conditions of wine. Exposure to stress during the multiplication of bacteria causes changes in the lipid composition of its membrane, which positively influences its fluidity. We also observe the synthesis of stress proteins, which, by associating with the lipids of the membrane, participate in the maintenance of its stability. Thus, the membrane acts as a bulwark against environmental stresses. Moreover, our production process favors the activation of ATPase pumps, allowing the excretion of protons and thus maintains their intercellular pH in wine conditions without the risk of accumulating acidity, which would cause their death. This maintenance of the intracellular pH also occurs during malolactic fermentation with the conversion of malic acid into lactic acid and the excretion of a proton. These steps are essential because without the activation of these mechanisms, the bacteria cannot survive nor multiply rapidly in the wine. We stop the growth of bacteria when they have reached an optimal physiological state. The liquid bacteria are centrifuged and washed to remove 75% of water. The concentrated cream is prepared for freeze drying. Freeze drying is a meticulous drying technique that allows to respect the integrity and the metabolic function of bacterial cells and therefore their good viability and vitality in wines. Moreover, with their very low water activity content, our freeze dried bacteria have a three year shelf life at minus 18 degrees Celsius and can tolerate brief exposure during transport up to 25 degrees Celsius for three weeks without damaging their quality. Subsequently, the freeze-dried bacteria are ground to powder form. The population of living cells by gram of powder allows a quick start of malolactic fermentation right after inoculation in must or wine. Finally, the bacteria are packaged in specific sachets meeting our requirements to maintain their stability over time. We have different sachet sizes to inoculate tanks from 2.5 hectoliters to 1,000 hectoliters.
Throughout the entire process, the quality control team performs many analyses for microbial purity and good viability of the bacteria culture. Before their release on the markets, we control the identity of the strains and we check their compliance with OIV specifications. In addition, and from our commitment to efficacy, we have developed specific internal quality tests to control malolactic activity in every batch produced. Our priority is winemakers' satisfaction who use our selected wine bacteria to control their vinification process and to optimize the quality of their wines. <laughs>